Hey, now you better eat this pasta, Jerry. I know how often you've been forgetting to take a dinner break. I have made your favorite to entice you. Thank you, sweetheart. What would I do without you? Ryan, make sure he eats every bit of this for me, all right? Aye, aye, Mrs. B. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You know you disgust me sometimes, you big sap. Can't help it, Ryan. I love the missus. She's my soulmate. Ah, there it is. Soulmate. She's my soulmate. Everyone's a soulmate. I hate that phrase. Soulmate. Soulmates. Oh, I got four soulmates. Oh. Cute. Are we really starting this again? Oh, you bet we are. Yeah, we are. In this day and age, predetermined soulmates, find out on your 18th birthday the first sentence your soulmate's going to tell you. You know the words, just go out and find them. Easy as pie, right? But you drive yourself crazy over this one goddamn phrase. Half the time it's nonsensical and half the time it's in a language you don't speak. Now you behave yourself. Don't be scaring off my customers. Hi, I'm Ryan Underhill. Here to welcome you to the finest establishment east of the Mississippi. The Owl's Rest Tavern. Don't mind him. <laughs> My apologies. He likes to think that he owns the place. Uh, take a seat now. Uh, let me get you a drink, Miss. Julia. Julia. Thank you. Um, a rum and coke, please? Coming up. Rum and coke? That's what I'm having. Except I'm about three in, so you're gonna have to catch up quick. <laughs> <laughs> she likes my jokes, Jerry. Yeah. She laughed at them. But that's the problem, isn't it? Jer. In this day and age, everything's planned out in advance, so you don't need a pickup line or a big cute. Uh, yes, indeed, sir. You are right. Mm. <laughs> don't mind him. You, you kind of caught him mid tirade. It's fine. Oh. Tirade? It stinks. Oh, it sucks. There's no tirade. The tirade is completely justified. Mm. Miss Julia, do you want to know what my supposed soulmate's first words to me are going to be? Welcome to Starbucks. Can I take your order? <laughs> it's funny, because it's Starbucks. Welcome to fucking Starbucks. <laughs> like, I never walk into a place like that. Oh, drop 10 bucks for a shitty cup of coffee? No, sir. Plus, there's a Starbucks in every corner. And there's a barista in each one who has to say the same damn thing. He, he really doesn't like Starbucks. I can tell. <laughs> it's just, there's something up with this, you know? If I don't walk into a Starbucks, I don't meet my soulmate. And if I never meet my soulmate, maybe she wasn't her all along. And what happens if I met my soulmate before I was 18? Now, I don't remember anything from the second grade. Maybe I missed her first sentence. Oh, and don't even get me started on the poor souls who open up that white piece of paper and see absolutely nothing. Just the whiteness of the paper. That's a tragedy. <sighs> Sorry, guys. You guys don't need some drunk guy waxing philosophical about something you've clearly thought about already. So Julia, what are your words? Uh, <clears throat> a, a proper lady doesn't tell, right? Mm. Neither does a proper gentleman for that matter. <laughs> I'm sorry, Jerry. <laughs> if you're looking for a proper gentleman, you're probably looking in the wrong place. Maybe I'm just trying to bring a little class to this part of the country. Big, beautiful, brown-eyed Jerry. I'm sorry. It's just that these things, they can mess you up a little bit. You know? I feel like it was supposed to be a blessing, and it ended up being a curse. So what's on the top of your mind, Julia? What's on the tip of your tongue? Welcome to Starbucks. Can I take your order? Nothing but a goddamn idiot. Oh, fine, pick up the letter you got stuck with, huh? <laughs> I'm sure he's not so bad once you get to know him. He does tend to grow on you, though I do have the helpful hand of alcohol on my side. <laughs> I'll just have to use my womanly wiles to bring Good. her around. <laughs> Good luck. But... To be fair, mine was a little easier. Hi, I'm Ryan Underhill. Here to welcome you to the finest establishment east of the Mississippi, the Owl's Rest Tavern. Uh, well shit, I didn't even give you a good chase. 
It's fine. I enjoyed the rant. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, you're what, 22, 23? If, if, if you knew for so long, why'd you wait? 26, actually. I was just starting my freshman year of college when I got my words and I was in California and you were just so far away. I, I kept thinking of the mess of trying to make this all work and I, I put it off. And before I knew it, I was living abroad working my dream job. And it sounds so stupid now, but I was, I was a little scared too, I guess. There ain't nothing wrong with that. It's a strange world, Julia. It's just nice not to face it alone. I hate it. <laughs>